We're live at Threat Stadium here in New York, New York, the home of the Tyrants. Who would like to remind you that the game will begin after the mandatory half an hour clapping is over. The first one to stop clapping will be killed. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Carolina Panthers battle the New York Tyrants. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. I'm a house If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cattle litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, NFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. with the punishing hit. And that'll be second and eight to go. down and well good luck maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too well they couldn't pick up a first down so now they have to punt and he booted a high arcing rainbow and he's got a chance for a good return here Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor And it's first and ten. Don't worry. If he shot and he fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. He's at the ten. He scores! If you think his dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. They used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf punch, Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. That was before the class even started. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Funny, I swear you're drunk. I'm not God, but seriously, stay in drugs, eat school, and don't do vegetables. Ah, Junior's having a flashback, man. What do we do? Down and talk so he out it comes up. Ah. Yes, yeah, I. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the defense was reading him like a book. What? Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe up. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. Yeah, that sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Hey, who don't do that? First down and nine. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks.
Second down and nine. Look out! That's an all-out attack on the QB. It's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. And that'll be second down and four. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. You know, back in the day when you scored a touchdown, you acted like a man, not the chorus girl. That's right. You looked up into the stands and murdered some big mouth who had been taunting you. You got that right. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And he's off to the races. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> First down in a mile. Hot, hot one, hot two, hey! at the last second. Nifty move there. The defense is on its heels. Great run on that play. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, devastating hit. Yep. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> hot, hot two. And he was stuck to him like glue. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Well, that's a lovely shake for the punter today. He just, no return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. It's a Bernard's time. And four. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. When the defense calls thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, give me an example so I'll watch out where the Huskies go. Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so
so good. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. Third down and five. And that's another turnover. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot two, three. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot three. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. First down of seven. Oh, he just got crushed. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. Second down and two. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the deep. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Second down and long. One speed, one engage. What are you trying to 
First and ten. That's a gain of ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. to one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. First down and six. for an easy kill. Second down and six. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. You need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Third down and eight. And 
And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The punter was killed, so now they'll need to find another player on the bench to punt from here on out. Yeah, who gives a crap about punters anyway? Punters' moms? Wives? Kids? Uh, but that's about it. And it's first and ten. continues to climb. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Ah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Grim. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. And the oh, with the brutal hit! First and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And that'll be second and eight to go. Cheap shot. <laughs> the New York Tyrants were eviscerated today and leave a wake of blood and tendons in his forfeit loss. They battled hard but still got their butts handed to them. Gross. I hope there weren't any old butts involved. I kind of like our butts, especially with some Dijon mustard and a smoked pickle relish. Now that's living. Let's go down to the field and see what the game's MVP thinks of today's outcome. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...